guys welcome back to the channel thank each and every one of y'all for clicking on the video if you're new to the channel i'm brandon this is my son layton and we just got another load of lumber um obviously we we woke up this morning went up to the lumber store just right down the road from us we've made three trip hey y'all better get that down from there we've made three trips so far but we ended up getting 40 of these studs um Obviously, it's taking a lot more lumber than what I expected, but I'm not a professional uh, wood carpenter. This brings back so many memories of us when we actually built the wood and American flags. Um, we would go down to Lowe's and we would load up a bunch of this and um, we'd bring them back and I would splice them up and everything like that. And then we'd start putting the flags back together. Hopefully, one day we'll get back to it. But um, also, everybody gives me a hard time about my wag bars. Here's the deal. These wag bars, we keep them in my unit and in the car back here. That way, the kids always ha has a snack, which they have four different kinds. This is the original. They have teriyaki, hot and spicy, and peppered. So I'm telling you, the wag bars are the way to go. We're going to put a link down in the description box if you decide to try the wag bars out or uh, use our the product code Eddie Family and you will get 10% off. Um, here's the deal: if you don't like them, our PO box is in the description box as well. Ship them right to us and we'll take care of them. But anyways, it's kind of like jerky, but it's got they're made with wagyu beef, 100% wagyu beef. Um, the company's here in Tulsa, which, we, which I spent quite a bit of time talking to them before we actually started um, collaborating with their product. Great Christian family, um, which one of them is a uh, retired officer out of Tulsa, Oklahoma, so we got quite a bit in common. Hey, y'all ain't getting my, my wag bars. Okay. No, I ain't getting no wag bars. No, my wag bars. Dead. Them my white balls, yeah. Yeah. Uh oh, oh. Yaki's down. They got the treats. They're taking over. Uh, animals, we keep snacks for the animals as well. So that's what they're actually uh, smelling. Um, but yeah, we keep them in the car and sometimes we come back and the kiddos is eight, about six or seven of them. Um, which they're supposed to be snacks, not meals. And that's what we use them for. But anyways, we're gonna go ahead and get this unloaded. We're gonna get this unloaded and get started. This actually makes 80, 80 of them. Oh, um, you take one. Drop them. This is 200 and something dollars worth of wood. That's a tree, but that's hey. part of it. So hopefully one day studs Hello, will go buddy. down. I can remember when Hello. these eight foot studs was Wait. running three dollars a piece. Now they're like five something. So anyways, we're gonna go ahead and get started. I need a rope and tie him up a lot in here. And I need a rope and tie him in here and I will let him go. Run right with me. Is that his own stall? Yeah. What? Uh, so we went up to the road, up to Marie's, and got the uh, truck and trailer. Um, somebody's going to have to use it. 
um, this evening. So we are going to unload everything right here that and, and get a tarp and actually cover it up. Um, kiddos, if y'all would bring them down here, son. Um, so we're going to unload everything and then we'll put a tarp over it. After that, we've got about two or three hours I can work out here and then I got to go to work at six tonight. So we will just kind of uh, try to do whatever we can uh, to get it done. I'm, I'm kind of hoping that we can actually get this done before we get the trailer moved out here. But I don't know if it's going to be possible just due to the fact I did not realize how much lumber uh, is going to take and how long it's going to take. Um, obviously when you get into buying a bunch of lumber you know it gets kind of expensive so we may have to wait until next month uh, to get the rest of it for the ceiling but um, William and Marie uh, they've got a uh, enclosed trailer uh, they said that we could keep our stuff stored in until we actually got uh, this building uh, built and you know I just can't say enough for what they have done for our family just helping us out just they've helped us so much guys and you know she's trying to start a youtube channel she's got a good she's monetized she's trying to get videos going and go over and show her some support um it's twisted b minis go over like and subscribe and leave her a comment i know it's rough when you first start a channel there's times that you want to quit just because you don't think you're moving fast it is going to be hard because one of her first videos she posted it did get go viral and it got like 180,000 views or something like that and so after it go you know falls out of the algorithm your videos go back to you know three or four hundred especially when you got you know 1500 subscribers I remember those days but go over there and show her some love like and subscribe to her channel and tell her Eddie Family Farm sent you. We greatly appreciate it. Uh, just know when, just remember when you've tried to start something, how hard it, it is to stay focused and build confidence. So go over there and do that for us. We'd greatly appreciate it. And uh, we're going to get started. Huh? You open that by yourself? Yeah. Oh, we got some cows in here. Yeah. What? Well, you don't want, of course. You got a phone. All right, we're going to get the saw out. <clears throat> we're going to take, we only need, well, let's do it. Just in case. One right there. Take one all the way to the edge. Right there. to put those to the side so they can stay on top? No, because the floor's got to go on first. Addison, scoot that two before now. Layton, help her. the briars you're gonna have to get at the other end. Let's get that um two four in here. There you go. Two too much. Okay. Use Addison, y'all can get all two. No, well it shouldn't help, I just I wanted to know. Open that 
I've just noticed this, uh, I don't mean these things a little bit heavier than the other. You want? I just noticed we did get four. I thought we was going to have to go back and get some more. Jump on him. Run off with it. Is let him run off with it, and he might um stop. That might be angry. I already get this side done. trying to think like that would be good because the camper's going right there right? right but after the camper is gone i mean yes it'd be a good spot because of the animals but do we want to just make it go this way Put it on the outside? Yeah, you'll put one on the bottom and then one on the top.
sit up again? All right, set it down. Perfect. Set it down slowly, take a break. See if you can really pick up on this. You think you need to push that bottom right, one in? On, hold on. Get to the other side. It's pretty close. Oh. I mean, he's gonna have to push on Brandon's side. Wow. Perfect. that we got I don't know what they actually called it I just told them what I needed and that's why they got them but the kids have done a great job helping me uh, prepare this Layton's over here, he's gonna back the car in and put it over here in the shade because we have our GoPro batteries charging and they are hot inside that car. today it's a little bit of liquid nail we're going to put the liquid nail in there that way it has sealed it up really good and uh, hopefully we don't have any issues so we're going to do it um, then we'll finish the floor it's coming together pretty good um, especially for the first time never actually trying to build something the proper way I built many chicken pens with the kids but you know like the kids always want to be involved so it takes a little bit of time but these are memories we will never get back we'll always have them so anyways i hope you all enjoyed this video if you have not be sure to like and subscribe and leave us a uh leave us a comment down below so thank you so much we're gonna cut this off and this is gonna be uh Hot super glue. basically Sunday, I
a second. Once we get everything lined up, y'all can go back and re-screw those. Y'all can lay it down on there now. Oh, I can't stand my word cup. Collapse, collapse and die. Start up. Over those screws. I got those. No, move. All right. Did you see that? Pull back my leg. Are those for me to shower? All right, guys, we got our first. Well, wall, frame, wall, up. Um, man, it's uh, kind of going together pretty good now. But, um, so I guess we won't get to complete this today. Um, obviously, we will have to come back and it, it'll probably be several days before we get to complete it. But hey, that's a pretty good showing if you ask me. Um, I know all the carpenters out there is like, that ain't no big deal, they do this every day. Well, here's the deal. That's a big deal to us. So that's a big achievement. We're super excited. And uh, we're going to see how much more we can get done before we head to Layton's ball game tonight. Well, that's super tall. Yeah. All right, guys, it's about 345 now. We've got three of the walls up. Um, we're going to have to call it quits for today. And uh, we're going to go play some ball, or Layton is. We're going to go watch. So um, we want to thank each and every one of y'all for watching. If you're not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe to our channel and check that notification bell. That way you don't miss any of our latest videos. Thank you, and God bless.